Okay, this is a uh, quick, I should be in bed already, video. It's a response to uh, a video that's titled, uh, let's see the title here, Muslim Woman Tells the Truth About Islam. And it's apparently some sort of a news TV interview, uh, kind of like a talk show, he said, she said kind of thing. And uh, during the course of it, she said, and I'm trusting the subtitles because it was all in Arabic, the, that uh, the kind of rules, the dogmatic rules that Saudi men have that uh, prevent women uh, from expressing themselves on TV and so forth uh, and having their own identity, that those uh, caused a condition where life was a hell on earth for people. And uh, I feel pretty strongly about this, and I have uh, written about this in the past. Uh, got a short blog entry about it, and I'll have, there's a, there should be a link down there. It'll take you right to it. It's a short read, and I think you might like it. Or even if you hate it, you still uh, give it a read and argue with me if you don't like it. Um, it it's puts together the case. It's like a more of a you know like a mathematical type proof, but it puts together a proof that any religion which has a concept of hell is a terrorist organization. Uh, before you jump to histrionics in the comment section, there's different levels of terrorism. There's suicide bomber terrorism, and uh, there's genocide terrorism. And uh, there's mental torture and anguish terrorism, or uh, as we call it here, bullying. Uh, so uh, give a quick read. Maybe uh, click and view the video that I'm referring to um, and give a comment. Love it or hate it, say something. Bye.